Kind of reminds me of a Dodge Viper theme. If I were to get one, I'd probably would go with this one. Welcome back to the Drive 615 channel. My name is Byron Glover Jr. Hope you guys are doing well. Right now we are headed up to Bowling Green, Kentucky from Nashville, Tennessee. That's where the 615 and Drive 615 come from. That's where I was born and raised. We're headed up there right now. Over the past eight months, I've uh, filmed about a dozen videos of C8s, either trying to find them or just filming them around town or driving them. So I uh, have got a lot of CA content. I'm hoping to bring some more. I came up here the other day and found an accelerated yellow convertible and a white convertible. The convertibles are a little bit more rare than the coupes these days because they're still rolling out. If you haven't seen the video I posted with my friend Jeremy's red hardtop convertible, check that one out. But in the meantime, we're gonna head up there now, see what we can find. I'm gonna bring you guys along with me. So stay tuned and uh, enjoy guys. Welcome to Kentucky. There's you a pretty Kentucky sunrise. Almost 7 a.m. And we have arrived. I always like to first come over, check out the plant, then run by the museum, and then just kind of cruise around. But let's see what we can find today. Starting off strong, we've got a, what looks to be a blade silver convertible right off the bat so we'll hop out take a quick look at that then we'll run around uh up front we've got a blade silver convertible here Continue on. Head up through here, see what we can find. Some older generations. Got a white Z51 coupe. And then a Zeus bronze, non-Z51. And then another Hard top convertible right there. Let's continue on. Got a whole truckload of C8s going out. Pretty cool, always cool seeing truckloads of cars, especially when they're all wrapped up like that. We got some C8s coming in hot. Got one coming towards us right there. Oh, that's a pretty, that's a convertible. Nice. I like that. All right, let's see what else we've got. Got a, what looks to be two convertibles. This one is that body color painted one that we've seen before. Body color nacelles. Then over here is a convertible with the non body painted nacelles. There's a cool silver convertible right there. That one's pulling back in. Oh, we got some pretty colors back there. You got a uh, uh, accelerate yellow and there's a whole bunch going back there. But anyway, pretty cool. There's a good perspective for you. So there's car top convertible with the 
black nacelles. And there is body color. Also, black roof versus non black. And the A pillars there. So, there's both side by side. If I were to get one, I'd probably would go with this one, honestly. I think it looks a little bit more aggressive, slim and trim, kind of. Um, there you have it. There's just a good perspective of it, side by side, practically. And then this is Z51 versus non Z51. I'm gonna run by and see what's going on over at the museum, then I'm gonna head on back home. We got a couple here at the uh, museum. Let's take a quick look at those. This one looks pretty cool, it's got some stripes on it. This looks to be a torch red Z51. Kinda all wrapped up, ready to go for someone. But this is pretty cool. ELB with stripes, Z51. Nice. Nice. What do you guys think about this one? I, I think it's pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of a, like a Dodge Viper theme. I remember there was a casino I was at in Vegas a while back, passing through, and you could win a Viper, and it was a blue Viper, it's either silver or white stripes, can't recall, but pretty similar setup to this. I haven't really observed the stripes very much. Let's just take a look at it real fast. So they end right here where the body color of the vehicle ends. They don't continue down here to the diffuser or anything like that. They do come up behind the plate. They do go straight through the Corvette emblem. Begin right here over the brake light. Kind of swoop in on the Z51 spoiler. It's kind of interesting. I've never really, again, observed it. I've seen it from a distance. And then they do swoop down the spoiler. Kind of split through the Stingray logo. And pick back up right here. And then Continue all the way front windshield, pick back up right there, of course, and then come all the way down and end right there where the body color ends again. Pretty interesting. There you have it. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like, a comment, share this video uh, wherever you share videos, Facebook, MySpace, uh, whatever works for you. And uh, appreciate the support, guys. We'll see you in the next video. See ya.